Okay, so if you would, can you kind of just tell us uh, about the last couple of days and coming here for this uh, week of practice and hopefully beyond? Yeah, no, it's uh, it's great, great opportunity for myself, and um, you know, obviously, I was very excited to to get the news, and um, you know, these are the opportunities you, you wait for and and you work for, so um, you just got to take advantage of the opportunity, and you know, it's going to be a good week of practice for me, and um, you know, I got to get used to the pace here and and, uh, and the speed of the players, and um, you know, hopefully uh, earn a, a roster spot into into some games here. Is that what they told you was up for grabs, or, or, or you know, what's kind of the message? How are you viewing this? Is more than a showcase, perhaps? Yeah, I mean, any, anytime you get a, a chance to showcase your your, your game, um, you know, you got to take advantage of it. And, you know, you only get so many so many opportunities in this profession, and um, you know, this is a big one for myself. So, um, you know, they, they they don't give you too much information on uh, on anything, but. Um, you know, I'm I'm here and, and happy to be here, and I, I just gotta you know keep keep working hard and, and uh, hopefully, like I said, get into some games here. Does it play on your mind a little bit when you hear he's gonna get a call up sometime this season, and you wait and you wait and you wait, and here we are after the Olympic break, it finally happens? Well, I mean, it's yeah, it's a, definitely a, a grind mentally. Um, you know, you, you I mean, you're you're getting lots of games and, and lots of minutes in the American League, and um, you know, for for me at my age, I think uh, that, that's important too. Um, you can't overlook that and. Um, you know, I got to keep getting better here with, in all areas of my game, and um, you know, I thought this summer was a, a big summer for me, and, and you know, getting stronger, and, and um, you know, I feel like I'm, I'm physically ready to play, and, and um, you know, now, like I said, it's, a, it's an opportunity for me to, to showcase that I'm, I'm re NHL ready player, and um, that's what I got to do. Do you think of switching to the right side? That seems to be the <laughs> easiest way to get up here. <laughs> Ever cross yeah. your mind at some point? Yeah. I can play right. <laughs> No, it's uh, you know that's the way that things work, and and um, you just got to stick with it through those things. Dave said, "Ready for the tempo of today's practice? Pardon me? Were you ready for the tempo of today's practice? We're running yeah. delay." Yeah. Yeah. Um, no, it's I, I'm I'm game ready. You know, I we played last night, so um, you know it was good for me. And those guys have been off I think for 10 days now, so um, you know I was trying to push the pace as much as I could, and, and, uh, and you know get them going again. Yeah, he was good out there today. I don't know if you guys saw him, but he was, he was pretty sharp. Brandon, who have you been playing with down there, and how have things been going? I've been playing playing a lot of guys. Um, you know, obviously, uh, Klesla came back down, and I was playing with him for a little bit, and, um, and Murphy here and there as well. So, um, you know, I was you're kind of playing with everyone down there, and, and uh, it's good for you, though, too. Um, like I said, playing lots of minutes and um, just trying to to keep pushing myself to, to get better and get stronger and, um, you know, be an NHL-ready player. Has the leadership role helped too? Have you felt that, you know, having an A carry yeah. any more effect? Or well, I mean, I've always kind of tried to try to be a leader on a team and, um, you know, growing up, I've always been uh, been one of the leaders on the teams and, um, you know, it's it's as a first-year player coming in, you, you try to do your best, but it, it's, it's different. And, um, you know, going into my second year and, um, you know, when I got sent there after camp, it's uh, I was happy to have, be put in that role. And um, you know, there's a lot of good leaders down there, and, and I'm still learning from from those guys. And and uh, you know, it's a it's a good opportunity for me. Dave said something interesting. He said it was almost like you're playing too much down there, where you had to pick your spots. Did it feel like that to you? At some points, maybe. Um, I mean, you never complain about the ice time, though. You, you want to be out there in all those key situations, and. Um, but yeah, I think sometimes you, you your body does get a little worn down, and um, you know I I had to, at the start I think I was you know I wasn't managing the game well enough myself, and you got to keep your shift short, and especially when you're playing a lot of minutes, and um, you know those little things add up, and by the end of the game in the third period, so um, you know we kind of figured that out throughout the year, and, and uh, I've been playing better as of late. Can you elaborate just a little bit on practice today? I mean, obviously, Coach was telling us he was trying to make everybody skate as much as possible while trying to disguise that. But, I mean, he's joking around, but that's what it was, wasn't it? Yeah, I think so. Um, you know, like I said, for, for myself, I'm, I've been playing here, so... Um, you know, I was good to get the good to get the legs going, and and uh, for those guys, though, I think uh, some of them are probably sucking wind. Um, you know, it's it's tough when you, especially you take ten days off in the middle of the season, and um, you know those you're used to skating every day almost, and you take ten days off and get back out there. It's uh, it's tough. So, um, no, they did a good job. They worked hard, and and um, you know we just got to keep pushing.